Hello everyone, welcome. My name is Mr. Perspective with your daily trading tips. Today, I'm gonna to be showing you exactly what's been going on in this channel, how we've been making coins, and today I'm gonna to be showing you how to read those graphs of those fire and ice, and knowing exactly when to pick up these cards to be making insane, insane coins. From yesterday, I showed you how you can literally double your coins, and today we did just that. We're also gonna be discussing about these informs. On Friday, there's going to be a good possibility of full sending your coins, and right now they're super cheap. When this SPC came out last time, the cards went all the way up to 38,000 coins, and the cards right now are about 30,000 coins. So there's a great opportunity to be making coins with those informs. We're going to be discussing all that and more today. Let's get going with today's content. Now, from yesterday's video, I told you guys, please, please, please invest in these fire and ice, please. I saw it's so clear that these cards were just going to explode. And today they did just that. From yesterday's video, I told you to pick it up at 1775. And today, don't worry if you missed out, you're going to be making bank again once again. So don't think you like you missed out on such a big thing. And yes, I do believe tomorrow they're going to rise again. Are they going to rise at the crazy amounts that they rose today? I'm not 100% sure, but I am 100% sure that you will make profit. Now, let me show you exactly what I mean and show you exactly what you could be doing. Now, these are the profits and these are daily, daily profits. Thank you so much for the people that follow me on Discord, people that are following me on Twitch. We do this every single day. We go live, show you what we're buying, and we go live to tell you what we're selling. This is the card that I picked up yesterday very simple trade very easy i took the day off i made the two videos i helped everybody pick up and i said you know what i'm gonna take the night off and relax and i did just that i enjoyed a nice little movie and today i'm fully charged to look and back and make some crazy crazy coins thank you so much and these are just the last 24 hours thank you so so much uh, my guy here showing that he sold his smith that he was just hoping for it to sell so GG's. Now let's talk about how to make coins with this and what to still pick up. Now over there on Discord, I also gave a couple flips for the people that have a higher budget. Now these are a little bit riskier, but I do think right now is their cheapest time to pick them up. Right now, some of my guys are already picking up and I do this for PC and console. I'm not afraid of trading in any of them. Now let's talk about the fire and ice cards, right? When to pick these cards up? Why did I see them? Such a good investment, all this good stuff. Now my favorite cards gotta be Sissoko. This uh, left wing, amazing type of card to flip. Dani Olmo. Those are my absolute favorites. Now let's look at the charts and see why I told you guys to full send your coins in these cards if you were at the right budget. Now let's see exactly what i saw and exactly what you can see going forward now on the market you need to be seeing positive and negative waves you want to be seeing ups and downs that are correlating to the market now you need to ask yourself certain questions and mostly trading with these cards is there more supply coming is there more demand for gameplay and do people have coins now, all these questions checked out last night, and I'm going to tell you exactly why. Now, we can see the fluctuation. This card was 10.75. I told you guys, pick it up. There's no risk whatsoever with it. Every single day, this card was rising to at least like 12,000 coins. Um, yeah, 12,000 coins, 12.5. And as you can see some, at, on PC, I think it made a little bit more. Yeah. So the card was rising. Now after content there was this big objective for this cup where you needed one fire one ice and people there was high demand so the market works like this right there's bubbles so the bubble goes up it reaches to a new level so you know this bubble is going to go next time higher here's the bubble one more time here's the next bump and it reaches higher so we do know that these bumps are positive bumps now when this came out this is what the first bump looks like right here it kind of it's it's a this is the middle of it this is the high part of it so you already know where it's going so the next bump 
will be right here. And this is pretty much when I made the YouTube video telling you guys, you know what? Pick it up. 1775. This card is gonna boom. A uh, brilliant, brilliant, because when you see these bumps, you think this bump is just gonna go fly down? No, no, no. This bump is going upward. And now the question was, is there more cards coming in? No, the question is no. People are done with their foot champs. There's no more packs being opened in the store. There's no more lightning rounds. There's none of that coming in. So there's only more gameplay and there's only more people with money because they just finished their foot champs. And now the attention is on this. And this is exactly what it did. So brilliant, brilliant type of trade, knowing exactly and answering yourself these questions. Are these cards going to come back in packs? Do people have coins? All that good stuff and you know and i told you guys over there on discord that this card was just gonna go down after content that's why we took those profits brilliant brilliant profits and that's perfect reading of the market and mostly with cars that are meta cars that are still in packs and knowing exactly what to do now for tomorrow we are going to pick up these cars and finally they're starting to like flatten out there's a price where people are gonna like mm, no longer let it drop anymore so i'm just waiting to see a nice positive bump just like over here like just a little one just a little one where it goes a little bit more expensive to what it was and i'm gonna attack it right there and i'm expecting this card to do once again very good i'm not expecting it to go all the way to 35 but it could go to like 23 25,000 coins why not going to tomorrow very easy coins and today you could be farming coins with these cards picking them up cheap selling them up and these cards are going to be so simple to be lazy listing now let's talk about another card that i picked up right now that is fluctuating and that maybe you can still pick up at this why i'm picking this card up now upamecano it's going to be the card and the reason why i'm picking up this card i know it's a cb but it's a very popular card and right now at this time you can still catch it on one of these fluctuations now the fluctuation of today will be right here and i'm going to show you exactly why i picked it up before content i wasn't 100 percent on this card and I, you can see he went to like fifty-six thousand coins so i said if he goes back down here I think it's a clear, clear buy. Let's see yesterday's price. Yesterday's price, let's see where he was at. The base of 59. The day before that, the base of 61. Now, on huge demand days, which is like Friday, Saturday, look at what this card went up to. I'm talking about 70,000 coins. Oh, do I expect it to go back to 70? Maybe a 69, 68,000 coins right here. We wouldn't be that bad picking up to sell this type of card. So today I was able to pick it up right here where I announced it to you guys. And you can see the positive bump. Probably this time it's going to stop right here at 58. And then the next bump is going to go upward just like it's done in the past couple of days here. Let's go to yesterday. Um, Here comes content time. Yep, content time card does a bump goes all the way down reaches once again that low point and just skyrockets back up skyrockets back up again this card i'm planning to sell these cards on friday if you're buying one of these cards off the list your optimal time to sell these cards are like friday saturday by the latest just a little fyi if you're trading with those flip cards for tomorrow we are going to be picking up those special cards of those fire and ice so don't miss out making those coins because you're going to be wanting to be like one of these people just pretty much making bank every single day now let's also talk about those informs because it is so simple to be making coins with those but it's also a little bit dangerous not knowing exactly where to pick these up Yesterday, the max we paid for these cards were like 30. So I heard some people getting them for uh, 31. It wasn't that bad getting them at that price either. Today, they lazy sold into 34,000 coins. A lot of people were lazy listing their cards for 35 during the day. They were able to make more coins that way. So if you're one to buy these informs, as soon as you buy them, please list them up. Today, probably the optimal price would be like 34,000 coins. 
on Friday comes a great opportunity to be making coins with these informs once again for the people that love full sending those coins or those informs. And the reason being is that icon SBC. And now that icon SBC is going to be so, so good to trade with. And this is coming on Friday. I recommend for you not to buy more than a hundred team of the weeks. I know sometimes you would like to buy 200, 300 team of the weeks, but now that day, it's a little bit dangerous because it's a day of promo, a day that EA likes to drain the market with those 84 times 10. So I do expect EA to do that again. And I do expect EA to make their coins with those informs. They love doing it. This one's going to be really, really expensive asking for two team of the week. So I know they're going to go up. Last time that they went up, they went to 38,000 coins when we picked up for 30. So it was some really, really nice profit. And again, these cards are once again at 30,000 coins, but I think they can go lower. So don't miss out. Put me on alert. You will not want to miss out. And we'll be making a video explaining exactly why you should be full sending your coins in this. Have a good one. It is Mr. Perspective with your daily trades. Get buying. I'll see you later in the stream buying those fiery nights. Thank you so much for everything. Peace.